Hi guys. So I was trying to think of paranormal things that have happened to me because I really want to make a video because I know you guys love my paranormal videos. And before I start, I know I look really bad. Um, my makeup's done, but my hair isn't. Like this is what I look like when I'm just cleaning my room, but I'm procrastinating right now. So I just figured I'd make a video. Anyway, back to the point. Um, yeah, I was trying to think of things that have happened to me and I couldn't, like, I was trying to, I was asking my mom and I was like, what, what's happened? Like, you know, because I really love making the videos for you guys, but I can only make them obviously um, when something happens. So I was asking my mom and she reminded me of two things that have happened in the past maybe two weeks. Um, they're nothing that big, but I thought I would just tell you guys just because I know that you like the videos. So the first thing happened um, was it wasn't okay. And before I start, um, I've said this in a few of my other paranormal videos, that when things happen, I try, and even if it happens and my mum's there, we always try to kind of rationalise before we go, oh, that's paranormal. So before I tell you this story, I want you to know that there was no wind. Um, we always have the bathroom, door, the bathroom window shut because of the fact that um, when it's windy, the, if the bathroom door is open and it's windy, it makes the bathroom door um kind of not rattle but just kind of because there's like it's like a gap like the gap i don't know how to explain because i'm not like a friggin door technician i don't know but like there's a gap so when the wind blows it kind of just goes do 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 like on itself um so yeah um that's not what happened in this story but i'm just letting you guys know that we always have it shut when it's windy because of that fact and it's really annoying um so yeah um, me and mum were getting ready to go, where were we trying to go? I think we were getting ready to go to the Gluten Free Expo, which um, for you, those of you who can't figure out what a Gluten Free Expo is, um, it's basically this thing that like, I don't know if anyone knows what like the Easter show is in Australia. It's basically like that. It is held where the Easter show is, except it's only held in like this small thing. Um, and it's basically just companies and show, this is completely off the point, but people will probably ask. It's just when companies go and kind of promote their gluten free food. So me and mum were basically, we shut all the blinds because we left pretty early in the morning and we knew we'd probably be coming home late. So we shut the blinds because we didn't want people to see into our unit when it's dark. Um, so yeah, we had everything shut and we were standing, I can't move my webcam, but like the doors over there. But anyway, we were standing, I was standing, getting ready, waiting for my mum to like get all her shit together because she took so long. And I heard like the, the bathroom door start rattling and I was like, oh, maybe it's just the wind. But the thing that was different about this is it was like someone, it was really like violently rattling. Um, when it's windy, like it's windy now and it's pretty windy and the door's not even moving. And like when we went to the expo, it wasn't windy at all. But what I'm saying is it was like a vicious rattle, like someone was stuck on the other side trying to get out. It was like do 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 and it was like rattling really hard out. And I was like to mum, what the hell? And she was like, what does that sound? And I was like, it's the bathroom door. I can't believe I forgot about this. Anyway, um... Me and mum were like standing in the hallway, like right there. The bathroom door is that, like just there. That's not the bathroom door. That's my mum's bedroom door. But we were standing in that hallway, basically where that gate is, because I have it in the middle of the hallway at the moment. Um, and we were just standing there like watching the door rattle. And it wasn't the wind because it was like violently rattling. And I could see the door handle kind of twisting and turning. Like that doesn't happen from the wind. So I don't know what to make of that. But um, yeah. And the second thing that happened, this happened maybe, oh, I don't even know, like, I can't even tell you when it happened. It wasn't that long ago. It was like a week ago at most. Me and mum were sitting um, on the couch and we were eating dinner and we didn't have the TV on or anything. I don't even think I have music playing. I think it was like really quiet or I just had music playing a little bit. And um, we were just sitting there talking and we kept hearing like this murmuring. And now I live in units and I don't want to say this too loud because I have my window open, but um. I live in units, oh, I feel like it's all secretive. I live in units and the people above us, we can hear them talking sometimes, but they're Indian and I'm not being racist, but um, like they only speak Indian and it's really definite when they're talking and you can only hear it from my bedroom because like, I'm pretty sure I've said this in a video before, but like if my window's open and their window's open, that's when you can hear it. But um, this was completely different. So yeah, me and when we're sitting down, we were eating, um, just talking and all of a sudden we kept hearing like, this like murmur like this these like it sounded like men talking and um sorry Ali was just like looking at my phone and we couldn't figure out what it was and then we heard like a woman's like sobbing now let me tell you I've heard that before when I've been home alone I've heard a woman sobbing um I don't know where me and mum heard this from 
like I can't, we couldn't figure out where in the house it was coming from but um when I've heard it I heard it coming from the laundry and it is like a definite woman sobbing and I just realized how weird my hair color is ew anyway but yeah um so we just heard like men murmuring and then we heard like a woman sobbing and like it wasn't the people above us so I don't know what that was um and I'm pretty sure that's the only thing that's happened I think I don't know I feel like I've already said this I think I can't remember if I've told you guys this in the previous video maybe I have maybe I haven't if I have I'm repeating myself and I'm sorry but this happened not a while ago like a month ago at the very most a month ago but I think it was like two weeks ago three weeks ago um I was walking my dog down the back I think I said this on like blog tv or something because I've got like deja vu anyway um, and I was walking down the back with Ali and I heard like um, footsteps, maybe I haven't said this, I heard footsteps coming towards me and basically where I walk Ali it's really open so if you heard footsteps you would see whoever is making the footsteps. Like there's nowhere for them to hide and if there is they can't be walking while hiding Ooh. if that makes sense. That was Ali by the way, she's on my lap. She yawned. She's got a twitchy eye. <laughs> anyway um yeah and I heard these footsteps coming towards me and I was like oh my god like I'm already kind of a bit nervous going down there at night and it wasn't dark like it wasn't late or anything it was only like nine o'clock but it was still dark and I'm nervous as it is to go down there and I heard these footsteps and I was looking around and I was like what the hell um and then the footsteps stopped and then I heard like a <sighs> in my ear but it was like a guy's like it was, it was a guy like sigh, not sighing. Oh my god, that sounded really sexual. Like taking a breath or something right next to my ear, and I was like, holy shit! So I like ran back up. I'm sorry if I've already told you this, but anyway. So I'm going to go now because I need to clean my room, and I'm procrast. Pro oh my god, I'm so retarded. Procrastinating. Um, I don't know. Oh, I better move this way. Yeah, that's where I film when it's good lighting. But um, you can see all the clothes here. I need to hang them up. Yeah, that's my cleaning my room. I've got a load of washing on as well. I feel like such a housewife. Anyway, I'm going to go now. So I hope you guys are all having a great day. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.